Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 100% to find outfit video. And in today's video, we're going to take a look on where to find the science scribe uniform. So, let's not wasting time and jump right into it. So, first of all, here is how the outfit looks like on the character. So, as I said, it's a, a uniform. The hat the cowboy hat can be found in White Springs, the stalker bandana is an Adam Shaw bandana. Uh, those goggles over there, you can find it at the Sutton station if I'm not mistaken. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where is it? Oh, ah, here we go. Yeah, Sutton station, that's where you can get it. And now, how to get this science scribe uniform. Alright, so this outfit can be obtained by doing the data mine quest. Uh, in order to get access to this quest, you will need to complete the enclave uh, quest line, storyline, or whatever. I've mentioned it a couple of times because there's a lot of outfits you can get through this uh, event, right? Uh, have in mind that, that the best way to farm data is going to the White Spring service entrance and just uh, visiting the military wing. Then look at these uh, desks and you can sometimes find Oh, well, not sometimes, you will definitely find technical data uh, if nobody else farmed it, that is. And also, you can find more than one. So, I would recommend, I would suggest to pick up just one and come back here and uh, pick it up again and so, and so on because they don't add up. Uh, I did test it out and uh, you just make a sip, it's just one submission. So, once you take the technical data, uh, you will trigger the event. So, the event is called the forbidden knowledge that's how you do it so afterwards what you do is you will need to fast travel to Camp Ventura and have in mind that to get this specific outfit is a very rare chance very rare because I've been doing this event for a while and in the past a lot and this is the first time I'm actually getting this outfit and I'm already over level 300 <laughs> so yeah it's a very rare one if I'm not mistaken if I'm not mistaken, you have lots of different uh, engineers. Uh, si well, this is the science one, uh, scribes, and so on. It's just a whole bunch of them over here, to be honest. Uh, even the bomber jacket you get here. As you can see, I think one of the guys already just submitted one of the technical data. So you run down. Uh, if nobody did this event on the uh, server that you're playing on, this door will be locked. You won't need any uh, lock picking skills to open it. <clears throat> then you just pre pretty much come here and submit it. Let's see if we're gonna get also another sort of an outfit or something. <laughs> so that's how you do it. If you don't know how to start the enclave quest, uh, feel free to google it because it's a lot of chit chat and explanation. Okay, this time I didn't get an outfit. That sucks. But if you want to get started with the enclave, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, have in mind that I'm from Ukraine. Uh, you will need to navigate to the abandoned waste dump. There are going to be two death claws. You'll need to find the elevator, and once you get into the elevator, uh, that's where you will trigger the enclave. But you will not get immediate access to the military wing at the White Spring service entrance. So you'll still need to grind a few quests before you actually get access to that uh, wing. <laughs> so I hope this video helped you out, and if it did, you know, drill. Don't forget to leave that like. Leave your comments down below because I always get back to your comments. Please do not use profanity because those comments aren't going to be visible to anybody apart me. And if it's a lot of profanity, I will read it and delete it. If it's something that I feel I can let it slide, I will approve it and, and only then others will see the comment. So the best way not to get in on hold and thinking whether I'm going to approve it or not, just don't use profanity. That's it. And uh, the other quick warning is if you're to promote any third-party services that sell caps in-game currency uh, in-game currency uh, items I will ban you instantly so don't do that and uh, I do not accept that uh, what do you call it sponsorships as well so if you're part of the company and you want to offer me a sponsorship save your time don't all right so that's how it is and I hope you enjoyed the show I hope this helped you out and I hope this outfit right here will come to you quicker than it came to me because as I said uh, when I was under level 100 I used to grind this event a lot and this is the first time I'm actually getting it. I started doing this event uh, just because 
of my routine I jump all the time from one place to another and I thought why not uh, to get the technical data since I'm in White Springs so a lot of the times uh, have a little teleportation see uh, plus you get XP caps sometimes some legendaries so that's why I started doing this event as well on a daily basis so guys thanks a lot for watching if you subscribe welcome to Z Clan Gamer Z Solo signing out you have a good morning day and night whatever you guys lock in at and I'll see you in the next video bye like <laughs> um okay <laughs> <laughs>